guys, Matthew Meyer, MarInvest.com. I want to bring you your two-minute tip of the day. So today I want to talk about uh, playing in a sandbox as a kid. So, you know, when you were little and you would just pass the time playing with your friends, uh, and then there would be this kid that came over and would just kick the sand pile down. Uh, he might take your little shovel or your bucket. Um, he might put gum in your hair. You know, the little bully kid, right? Or you had the little girl that was crying, or you had the kids that wouldn't play with anybody else. They would go and hide in the... Did you guys have tires? We used to have these big tractor tires that were kind of half sunk into the ground, and so kids would get up in there, and half the time there would be wasp nest. <laughs> they would build, chase the little kids. Anyway, uh, you know, or you'd have the kids on the swing. So we're all over the playground, but most of the kids kind of did their own thing. And then... If you tried to play on the big toy, you had to be one of the cool kids to play, uh, you know, on a particular toy. They wouldn't let you on the toy, you know. So I've been trying to uh, talk to my ne nephews and nieces who are growing up and they're in high school now and they're kind of growing through some of these growing pains, you know, where uh, sometimes kids can be jerks, you know. And I told them that people are still jerks. <laughs> now, I've told you multiple times, I believe that most people are good. Okay, Most people are good. Most people in the world are just trying to do the right thing. They're trying to do the best thing for their family. They're just trying to work hard, get their paycheck, go home, have a drink, watch some sports or whatever. And everybody basically around the world, I've traveled some, and everybody's trying to do the same thing, just trying to have the best life they can. People, you know, I, I try to think of what's common in multiple languages and we cry the same in any language. We laugh the same in any language. So there are some of those things. But it's been my experience that in the real world, in the grown-up world, the sandbox is just bigger. So kids don't really grow up. People don't really act their age. See, the problem is everybody didn't have your mom or dad. Everybody hasn't had your influences. So here you're trying to do the right thing, turn the other cheek, go the extra mile, all these things, and that is not everybody else's experience. Some people have been taught you got to go out and destroy the other person, and that's how you win. Some people are taught, you know, that people are all people are going to take advantage of. All people are going to take advantage of you, and so you have to get all you can every single time. There's people that are all about taking care of themselves, not about sharing anything else. You know, they, they have a scarcity mentality, which we've talked about before, like this might be my last meal, it's going to be the best. And so they live to the extreme every single day because they don't know if tomorrow's coming. You know, and uh, of course, I don't live that way. You know, I believe people are good and I want to treat others as I would want to be treated. And I want people to, uh, you know, when I hold the door for somebody, I kind of expect people to hold the door for me. and. You know, if, if I stop and help somebody on the side of the road or they run out of gas and I help push their car to a gas station, I'm not looking for praise. I'm, I'm just hoping that the day comes where I run out of gas or have a flat tire, someone will, is willing to stop and offer to help me. So the point about all the craziness that we pass along on social media about people and how they are, the point is you be the change. You be the person that's doing the right thing, saying the right thing, rising above, being a person of influence and character. That's up to you. So you can't control what anybody else does. Believe me, people try. I'm a control freak. I would love to be like, hey, if you would just do this, you would be more successful. If you would do this, you would manage your money properly. And I wish somebody could do it with me. Matthew, if you, if you would just do this, you would lose some weight and stay that way, right? <laughs> so we're all disciplined in different areas. But So the point is, the sandbox is still a sandbox. It's just we're older. And uh, there's still bullies. There's still people that are out to get all that they can. There's selfish people. There's arrogant people. But I'm telling you, don't be that person. You be a person of change. You be a person of character. You be an honorable person. And you know what? It's going to affect those people around you. You cannot help but when you share a smile, when you share laughter, when you are good to people, especially for no reason, you're good to people when there's nothing you can get out of it for, but other than just being nice. You're just being nice. You will bless those people's day. You will be a blessing no matter where you go. I hope you guys 
Have a blessed day.